Hey guys, my name is uh, Tommy Wilson. I'm from Fort Worth, Texas, and I'm in my second year here at Oklahoma State. I'm going through the professional pilot program. Um, I'm going to talk to you guys today about some of my core values, some of the values that I carry with me um, throughout every day, um, throughout the decisions that I make, and um, just the things that really are the most important to me. Um, so we'll start with authenticity. Um, I think that a major factor in everyone's life is um, definitely a relationship. So um, not only romantically, but also, you know, friendships, um, professional relationships in the work field. Um, so I think that being authentic is how you attract people, um, you know, that could pinch, that you could potentially want to um, stay in your life. Um, so I think that being an authentic person, being genuine, um, is a great way to attract other people. And um, it's definitely one of my core values, and that's why it's so important to me. Um, I think that another one is going to be trustworthiness for me. So I feel that trustworthiness and um, being honest with one another is definitely um, the found out foundation um, of any great relationship. Um, so communication, and I think that in order to have great communication, then you have to have this um, this trust between one another. Um, so I definitely know that I'm I'm somebody that needs other people in my life. So I have three older sisters, and um, we were raised by a single father. Um, so. I feel that the trust that we had between one another um, was kind of, um, it definitely aided in the resolution of certain conflicts that we might have faced um, in my youth and just, just through growing up. Uh, so a third core value that I want to talk about is going to be responsibility. So um, responsibility, in my opinion, leads to growth. I think that there's no growth um, in said comfort zone. Um, so personally, I feel that I have a responsibility to, um, work as hard as I can in college and throughout my flight training. Um, and it's going to sound cheesy, but I have the responsibility to my future wife and to my future kids just to be the best version of myself that I can be. So I know the person that I want to be, I know what it takes to get there. So I'm just kind of doing all the things that I need to do in order to get there. Um, so like I said, responsibility to me means working as hard as you can. Um, in the classroom to get my flight flight ratings done as quickly as possible um, so that I can set myself up and set my future family up. Uh, so another one I'm going to talk about is going to be respect. Um, so just really having respect for everybody around you. Um, that's, that's really important to me. So I know that it's cheesy and we've heard it all since like kindergarten, but the golden rule is just treat other people uh, the way that you want to be treated. And I really think that if everybody did that, the world would be a better place. So um, you never know what somebody else has been through, therefore you really can't make assumptions about, um, about people at all. Another core value that is very important to me is going to be leadership. Um, so leadership makes me want to be productive and be the best version of myself that I can be. Um, so an e example of um, why this is one of my main morals is probably um, through one of my role models. So my dad is um, my role model. Um, just we, we've been through a lot, and he's been my best best friend um, for my whole life. So, um, and we're gonna get into another core value about this in a minute. But uh, whenever his mom died um, a couple years back, I saw just pure strength out of him, even whenever it happened. She had been sick for a while, but um, seeing his strength um, just kind of guided me to, um, you know, be stronger. And seeing his leadership throughout that situation. Um, just really had a big, big impact on me. Um, and so next one we'll get into is religion. Um, so my religion, I'm a Christian, um, and I believe that my religion gives me the, or gives me the perspective on life that I have today. And so I find comfort in the fact that, um, you know, this life is as bad as it's going to get for us. Um, so, you know, that gives me positive self image and, um, confidence in myself and like I was talking about just a second ago with my dad just seeing his faith throughout um, that tough time for him whenever his mom passed away um, kind of really boosted my faith in the fact that he showed such strength in in um, his faith so um, yeah that was another another way that um, leadership and religion kind of played together on that one so the last core value that I'm going to talk about is going to be balance so I think that balance is absolutely crucial, especially um, in a college situation. So, you know, just finding the ways to balance your social life as well as your education. And it's kind of different for those who are doing the um, aeronautical stuff just with, you know, we have 
flight lessons. Some of us have flight lessons on Saturdays or fly on Sundays if you can. So that can take a, um, you know, that can be a sacrifice that you have to make um, based on your social life. And I really think that if you want to be successful um, or in a, as successful as you can be, that life's about making sacrifices and, and having that balance. Um, so, but I also feel like it is very important to slow down and um, enjoy the little things. So like I was talking about earlier, yeah, I'm trying to get my, my flight ratings done as quickly as possible, but it's also important just to slow down and look around every once in a while. Um, so as far as the situation, when one of my core values compromised one another, uh, I would probably say that it was my freshman year of high school, or my freshman year of college. Um, I kind of sac sacrificed my religion for balance. So I think that um, it's common that all believers at some point or another go through a tough phase where sometimes they forget to work God into their daily lives. Um, so with me um, being a freshman, it's it was completely it was a completely new environment. I was having to deal with um, you know making new friends and um, you know these new classes that I had never really experienced before. So um, I kind of got easily wrapped into some of the external stuff. Um, so I kind of lost that. Um, perspective that, that, that my religion kind of gives me, just that positive outlook, and um, so that was kind of a tough time, but also I feel like since then I've done a lot better job of um, working religion, social life, and professional life into a more cumulative balance just to work them all in together, um, just because they're all, they're all very important in their own ways, um, so yeah, definitely. So the last thing I'm going to talk about is how can these um, core values that I've been talking about help me with my career in aviation. Um, so I believe that balance will help me with making sure that I'm not overworking myself and I'm still prioritizing my family because my number one priority whenever I'm older is going to be the father that I want to be and be the, the husband that I want to be and then work will come with itself. Um, my leadership will help me um, whenever I'm a captain one day or in case of an emergency. Um, I believe that these traits will be able to make it better and uh, be able to Help with the crew resource management that we will, that we learn about in a lot of other classes. Um, so yeah, definitely leadership is going to be crucial whenever um, in a situation like that. So religion will continue to help me give me my positive and um, uh, healthy mindset. I feel like um, respect will allow for me to be productive and um, allow for a safe working environment. Because if you respect one another, then there will be no hostility. Hopefully, hopefully. Um, responsibility will continue to teach me to do um, the most ethical things, even whenever nobody may be watching. So come uh, kind of incorporating the integrity thing into there. Um, let's see. Authenticity will allow me to continue to grow in my professional relationships. Um, so obviously in other relationships as well, but being authentic will, um, just with regards to aviation, will help me professionally. And trustworthiness will allow for the crew and passengers on the airplane to feel secure during um, the operation at hand. So whether, um, you know, that may be an emergency situation or just bringing people from point A to point B or cargo, whatever um, the future may have in store for me. Um, I just feel like all of these traits are crucial and um, I'm looking forward to growing through them and um, hopefully being the man that I want to be at the end of the day. So thank you guys for watching. Um, I'm looking forward to watching you, your guys' videos as well, so adios.